I'm Doug and I'm pissed. Last week, we did a video about the collab between the Tetris company and 7-Eleven to produce a playable Slurpee cup. That's right. It's a Slurpee cup device. I thought it was cool, but as I said in my uh, video before, it was really strange that you had all these different ways that you could potentially win one from buying a lunch bunch of 7-Eleven crap. But then there was also a place where you could order it on the 7-Eleven website. And of course, uh, at the time, it hearkened you to put in an email address and they would let you know when this magical device was in stock. Well, why are we making this video update? Well, very simple. Uh, I just got out of family dinner and in the middle of family dinner, my phone vibrated a little as I've said it to do when I get new email communiques. And so as anyone would do in 2024, when their little phone vibrates, they detach from being with their families and enjoying family and food and immediately go to their handheld device and find out what the email communication was. In this case, oh my goodness, I'm so glad I blew my family off because it was the email I've been waiting for. I got the announcement at 4.54 Eastern Standard Time today that the Slurpee device cup Tetris thing was now available to purchase. Now, I got this at, I believe, 4.59 or 5 o'clock on the nose. So it had only been about five minutes since this uh, notification came to me. So I said to myself, let's go. We're going to get ourselves a Slurpee Tetris cup. So I immediately made my little fat fingers click as quickly as they could onto the 7-Eleven website. And then I was greeted with this. Yes, that's right. It sold out in five minutes flat. That's right. Five minutes from the email blast that went out that the 7-Eleven Slurpee Tetris device was available for purchase for $30. It was already gone. Sold out. You can't buy it. You can go and buy a bunch of Slurpees and maybe win one in a lottery, but no one's got time for that. I'm a busy, important gentleman. I can't be doing that. <laughs> so for all intents and purposes, I've been frozen out of a 7-Eleven Slurpee cup. Now, I, it, again, I'm still angry, but you can just imagine how angry I was at the dinner table. So I counted to 10 about 36 times, and then I stepped away, and I said, okay, maybe, maybe it was a mistake. Maybe it was a glitch. Could have been a glitch. So I went to my personal computer here in the studio, loaded up the page. Nope. Sure enough, it's still sold out. And the condescending message that, hey, you had an opportunity, but you missed it, buddy. <laughs> Just really, like, really put me in that wonderful place. So I said, all right, who bought all the Slurpee cups? And I figured, well, I, I guess we could check eBay. Oh, they're on eBay. They're on eBay for multiples. Many, many multiples of the $30 asking price. To which I say to each and every one of you that scalped the 7-Eleven Slurpee Cup this afternoon on eBay, shame on you. And boy, I gotta tell you, I'm gonna be honest, I'm doing the convention scene this year, folks, so if you wanna see your old pal Doug from It's All Dougie Games, I'll be at the SoCal Gaming Expo, not as a formal guest, but wandering around as a fan. I'll be at the Southeast Game Exchange, I'll be at Retro World Expo. So, you know, you can see me. And I gotta tell you, if I go to one of these conventions, and I see a table full of jacked up 7-Eleven Slurpee Tetris devices. Oh, I'm going to be upset. I'm going to have a few strongly worded things to say to them. I don't care who it is. All right, I've gotten it out of my system. That was really all this video was about. Let me know if you were one of the lucky people in that five-minute window or less to get one. I would love to hear your story. Of course, please like and subscribe if you like the cut of my jib. And as always, I'll see you next time. It's all Doug and Games.